Two Kenyan teachers have been named in the top 50 shortlist for the 100 million shilling Global Teacher Prize Award 2019 set to take place in March. Maina Gyoko, a teacher at Aga Khan Academy in Mombasa and Peter Tabichi, a teacher at Keriko Day Secondary School in Nakuru, beat thousands of teachers across the globe to land spots in the top 50 list. NTV's uh, rather education reporter Sharon Baranga with a story on what sets them apart in the teaching profession. Good afternoon, class. Uh, a mathematics class is in session at Keriko Secondary School in Pwani Village, Nakuru County. This is, let's say this is A and this is B. The captain of the class is a Franciscan brother of the Catholic Church, Peter Tabichi, who also teaches physics in this school. Tabichi has a story to tell one that has influenced his nomination for what is the largest teacher prize award of its kind globally. And then next, you get the difference. Kariko Secondary School is not too well resourced. Tabichi has canvassed for donations to equip the school laboratory, boosted the self-esteem of his students by launching a talent nurturing club, a peace club for debating, and strengthening the school science club. I mentor the students who are later on able to proceed to different uh, uh, levels from sub county, county, uh, regional, and then up to uh, national level. Like now, in the year 2017, uh, we had some students who matched the best in uh, chemistry. And then last year, we also had a group of students who matched as the best in mathematics category. And of, uh, in general, our school was ranked the best public school in Kenya. Many of their projects have qualified for national competitions and the mathematical science team has qualified to participate at the Intel International Science and Engineering Fair 2019 in Arizona, USA. This also has translated into a good academic performance. He has also encouraged the other uh, members of staff uh, to use ICT uh, whenever they are teaching. Tabichi integrates ICT into 80% of his lessons. Hundreds of kilometers away from Nakuru is another teacher who is also carving out his own mark through his impact. Coincidentally, Maina Gyoko is also a physics, design, technology and world studies teacher at the Aga Khan Academy in Mombasa. Why do porters take tasks from elephants? He has also landed a spot in the Top 50 Global Teacher Prize Award, an initiative of the Vaki Foundation. You meet different people and they share with you their hopes and uh, you are able to facilitate and they realize their dream. That's what keeps me wanting to teach and engaging with the learners every day. Every year, Maina and his students conduct a dewarming exercise in their community, which is a learning opportunity for the class, as they have been able to monitor the level of wellness and the quality of water in the area, linking this back to their studies. The kind of contribution that he's making to the teaching profession uh, is uh, is quite significant and especially in the area of teacher development uh, both in the academy and also in the outreach program. Not only does that reflect really well on us um, and the work that we do at the academy but it's also a testament to the work that um, Mina has done in and beyond the academy. I will advise all the other teacher don't just be a compliant teacher try to do more than what you are supposed to do. Try to add more value in the lives of the people that you are having. Kenyan teachers have represented the continent in the 100 million shillings award, which is in its fifth year. The two tutors beat over 10,000 teachers who are either nominated or applied for the award from 179 countries around the world. A prize committee will narrow down the top 50 shortlisted teachers to 10 finalists. Thank you so much. The results will be announced in February and the winner will be crowned in March in Dubai. The Global Teacher Prize was set up to recognize one exceptional teacher who has made an outstanding contribution to the profession as well as to shine a spotlight on the important role teachers play in society. Sharon Baranga, NTV.